Hi, my name is Beth Philemon and I'm a Jenkins MBA candidate at the Poole College of Management here at NC State. I am joining you today on behalf of the Graduate School to give you some tips and guidelines as you near graduation and have questions about how to best wear your regalia. When you go to pick up your regalia, you'll head to the lower level of tally in the Wolfpack Outfitters store. Pick it up and you first want to make sure that you work to get the wrinkles out. Do not get the wrinkles out of your robe through ironing it. Your robe is made of actually recycled plastic bottles and an iron will cause it to melt. Instead, take your robe out of its packaging and hang it in a shower so the steam will take out some of the wrinkles or use an actual steamer to get rid of some of the wrinkles. You'll notice that when you go to put on your robe, the sleeves are a little funky. There's nothing wrong with your robe. Instead, this is what the master's robe regalia actually does look like. And there's little holes in the top of the sleeve for you to put your arms through. So you want to make sure that you have someone to help you with this next part, and that is your hood. So I have a special assistant here to help me with the hood, and you'll notice that there's two strings coming out of it. We'll talk about this string in just a moment, but the most important one is the one at the very top, and where this crease is, is going to go around your neck. Once you put the hood around your neck, you're going to take this string and find on the inside label of your robe is a little bitty button. And you're going to wrap that string around the button and then you can zip up your robe all the way. Now notice that this is already beginning to fall off my shoulders. So here's where your special assistant comes into play. So we're going to pull the velvet section of your hood over across your shoulders and there's a string on the back. You'll take the string from one side and attach it to the button on the right side. If you're a little bit shorter like us, you may need to tie a knot in the string to pull the sides of the hood closer together. And then you flip the colors, the red and white colors, to the outside. And it's important to note that your hood colors are dependent upon the school that you are actually graduating from. So as a Poole College of Management student, that determines the colors of my hood. Now, you're almost set to walk across that stage, but the last thing you need to do is take your hat also known as a mortar board, and it's conveniently labeled on the inside which part is the front and which side is the back. Once you've put the hat on, because you have already graduated from undergrad, you will not be moving your tassel. Therefore, undergrads, the tassel is on the right. Graduate students, the tassel is already on the left because you've already moved it. And you are set and ready to go to graduation and celebrate the awesome accomplishment of being a graduate of the North Carolina State University Wolfpack. Go Pack!